Hello, I am Shubhendu, a cloud support engineer head at the AWS office in Bangalore, India. Today, I am going to show you how to remove the default port 25 throttling placed on Amazon LightSail instances. Let's see how we can get this restriction removed. As you might already know, AWS blocks outbound traffic on port 25 for all LightSail instances. This block is put in place because port 25 is the SMTP port used for non-secure email. And blocking this port is an email spam prevention measure. When port 25 is blocked, you might get an error such as connection refused or unable to connect to SMTP server. To request AWS to remove the port 25 restriction on your LightSail instance, follow these steps. Sign into the AWS Management Console as the AWS Account Root User. Then navigate to the LightSail Console. Open the request to remove email sending limitations form in a new tab. This is linked in the Associated Knowledge Center article. Enter your email address. Provide the required information in the use case description field. This information must include a clear and detailed use case for sending email from your LightSail instance. Also provide a statement outlining your plan to confirm that your account isn't implicated in sending unwanted emails. Because this form is common for various services, Provide confirmation that the request is for the LightSail service and the region where your instance is hosted in. You can also provide the LightSail instance name. As an option, you can provide the static IP address that you currently use to send outbound emails. You can also set up a reverse DNS record. To do that, enter the RDNS record that AWS must associate with the static IP addresses. When you send emails, it's a best practice to set up an RDNS record to help prevent outbound emails from being flagged as spam. Make sure to link the RDNS record to your static IP address using a DNS A record. For example, if mail.example.com is the RDNS record that you're setting, be sure that you create an A record for mail.example.com that points to the static IP address. This is the domain that is done when the reverse DNS lookup is performed. Submit the form. Note that these limits are approved for each region this means that you must submit a different form for each region. After the form is submitted, you'll receive an email with the request ID on the submitted email address. It can take up to 48 hours to process your request. If your request is approved, you'll receive an email to notify you that the port 25 restriction is removed. If you don't receive an update within 48 hours after submitting the request, then reply to the initial email that you received and request an update. So now you know how to remove the default port 25 throttling placed on light sale instances. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.